Hello Capricorn and welcome back to my channel. If y'all are new, my name is Jazz. If y'all are not new, y'all already know what is up. We're gonna get right into these messages for you Capricorn. So just sit back, relax and take a chance. Smash that like button or leave a comment down below, but don't forget to make sure your monkey butt is subscribed to the channel for more content and for more of me, Capricorn. We're taking a look at the overall energy that you may be experiencing at this time. Getting into the shuffle here for Capricorn, please, Spirit. What are the messages they need to know or be aware of? Capricorn who's here with us. Capricorn who needs a message at this time. Wow. So straight away, you have spiritual gifts popping out with the twin flame card at the bottom of the deck. Are you? Wow. Wow. Capricorn. Spiritual connection seems to be coming through here. A very strong spiritual connection. Spiritual gifts with the spiritual card. There's this sense of, of a connection, right, in the, in the higher dimensions. This is also about alignment, right? This is about alignment with your higher self. This is about alignment with um, your own spirit guides, your own team. You know what I'm saying? So there's a heightening energy that's coming in for you, Capricorn. This is Capricorn season. Whoop. D whoop, scoop, de scoop. All right, Capricorn, show us more here, please, Spirit. You guys are definitely being downloaded. You're you're receiving a lot of messages here. I feel like this is a part of the plan here. It's a part of the plan. So you have the spiritual card, life purpose mis mission with challenges and material abundance. I feel like your spiritual gifts or your spirituality. The heightening that you're receiving is actually helping you overcome any challenges, any obstacles that you guys are dealing with. I feel like there is an alignment again with what you're supposed to be doing here and as well as your finances, Capricorn, as well as your finances. There's there's a very beautiful energy here to be unlocked. And it's like someone is actually stepping into a full spiritual purpose here, a full spiritual mission where it's it's. It's like you've overcome this block or challenge within your root chakra. You be, you began to have faith and believe, you know, in your in your own um, intuition, in your own inner wisdom, in your own higher knowledge, in your own ancestors and spirit guides, right? And you begin to do the work. Like somebody's really having a breakthrough here. And this is with your life purpose, your mission. This is with your career, your job, your business, whatever it happens to be, Capricorn. There's a breakthrough because of the, he the healing, right? The, the true um, work that you actually did for yourself that was done here. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look ski and see what messages want to come through here for the collective. Hi, pumpkin. As it relates to this energy here, please, Spirit, show us what Capricorn needs to know or be aware of here. Tell us about this current energy. Tell us about this situation and what Capricorn can expect here. Tell us more about this energy and what Capricorn can expect here, please, Spirit. Tell us more about this energy and what Capricorn can expect here, please, Spirit. Three more. Yeah, death at the bottom of the deck. It's definitely a, a huge transformation and it's a huge life, um, life pivot that you guys are experiencing or going through here. Show us more for Capricorn and what they can expect here with the situation. Show us what we need to see for Capricorn and what they can expect in this situation, please, Spirit. Tell us more about Capricorn and what they can expect in the situation. Five of Swords with the Emperor trying to come out. There's a little bit of like ego balance or ego challenge that seems to be going through. But show us what wants to come through here. Page of Wands. 
very nice, very nice. Lots of messages that are coming through here. Page of Wands is the messenger. This person comes forward, they say something, right? These could also be downloads that you were receiving from your angels, your ancestors, your spirit guides. And I feel like they are uh, downloads that are quite successful. People may also be seeing you as... Um, enlightened like a very enlightened and successful um and prosperous individual here especially with the world and the page of cups someone can people can almost see you um as someone who is beginning to become like a prophet or someone who is beginning to become you know world world known worldwide and you could be like in the young stages you know of this situation giving messages receiving messages or you know what it is that you're projecting out into uh the universe basically what it is that you're giving to the world what it is that you're giving to your people here with the page of wands and this this eight of pentacles is is showing us this has, has a lot to do with the effort the energy the work that you are putting in here capricorn right so show us show us more for capricorn with this page of wands here please spirit yeah ace of wands this is a very inspired energy you guys are on the freaking ball right so there is something like literally being blasted into your your brain hole your intuition hole right and you're receiving all of this energy this spiritual energy because the wands is spirit right it's fire it's spirit it's 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 innovation it is also um inspiration so i really enjoy ooh, i really enjoy these energies the ace of wands the page of wands that you guys are receiving because it, it's it's like a confirmation for you that you're y'all <laughs> on the right on the right path on the right track leaving the crap that you need to leave behind behind and really taking charge of your own life here show us more here for page of wands ace of wands with this current situation and what capricorn can expect lots of downloads like you guys may even just feel more inspired to do things here capricorn as well yeah we have the six of wands and the world yeah there's some sort of success that's coming in here for you it's like you're becoming more known worldwide world it's it's something in that manner capricorn and i really do enjoy this and i feel like it's almost like this things are coming full circle for you like it feels good like you you are for whoever this is for you know your spiritual gifts um I feel like they're taking charge and i feel like they're actually becoming elevated i feel like this is also like your your spirit's way of like celebrating the fact that you are graduating to this next level of enlightenment and of understanding here okay so this is really really nice bottom of the deck is the page of cups the eight of pentacles and the seven of cups with the star with the queen of swords so what i'm going to say here is there's a lot more clarity it's like the work that you've been doing has been creating a lot more clarity here for yourself capricorn in regards to divulging you know certain information and being able to read and and do all different types of things for your business or whatever this happens to be i love this for you hmm let's actually take a look at what the block may be here in this situation let's take a look at what the block may be in this situation show us what we need to see here for capricorn sun moon rising venus and jupiter and what the block may be in this situation with this challenge energy look at that the devil at the bottom of the deck your energy and I, I feel like this is about letting the actual wheel move forward letting things go in the manner that they're supposed to go allowing yourself to receive the messages that you're supposed to receive I feel like this is all about letting yourself transition capricorn right allowing like releasing that that sense of control from the situation and kind of allowing yourself to just flow into this next level yeah the devil the queen of wands excuse me and the six of cups i i feel like you know this can really block your true creativity here i'm getting with the queen of wands and the six of cups you know trying to control the situation can really block out your create your creativity and and that energy that you can really bring to the situation here so this is really about flow and bringing flow into your life here capricorn i really like this ba, 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 ba. 
how can Capricorn allow this flow to flow? <laughs> how can, you know what I mean? How Capricorn, how can you allow this flow to flow? Hmm. It's interesting. Bottom of the deck already is failure here. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. Yeah, forgiveness. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love. The flow. How interesting, right? How interesting. So this is about forgiveness. Forgiveness to yourself, forgiveness to others for the situations, trials and tribulations that you've been through. How can Capricorn overcome this energy, please, Spirit? Thank you. Patience. I accept that everything happens in divine order. Capricorn, this is this is truly about being patient for your blessing, right? And understanding that happiness means you are on the right path because you are on the right path. In, in order to really enjoy this energy, spirit's trying to keep you on this path, and that is through flow, Capricorn. That is li literally through flow. So I, I really like this for you because it's about allowance, right? It's about allowance. Show us more here for Capricorn. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like allow yourself to be happy. Allow yourself to be in flow. Allow yourself to be in balance here, Capricorn. Allow yourself to enjoy your energy, right? And, and do the things and, and work on the things and move towards the things in your future that make you happy. Show us the energy in the near future here for Capricorn. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs, please. Show us the energy of the near future for Capricorn. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs, please. King of Wands. Definitely um, some big creator energy here. Definitely kind of like top of the creativity charts doing you know yeah this is like a passion project and and being you know good at it taking charge of it and honestly like leaderboard type energy i'm he hearing which is nice yeah queen of cups this is because this is something that you are quite passionate about you're quite engulfed in and it makes you feel so good so you you are very um you're very able right and and it's almost like you take the reins right you take the reins and you allow yourself to basically do what needs to be done and fulfill your role here, Capricorn, because we have the Tower, the Hierophant, and the Page of Pentacles. There is a major change, major life change that's happening, and it's happening on a spiritual level. And that Hierophant is about you unlocking that box there, right? You're unlocking that box to more knowledge, more wisdom, and, and it's allowing you to understand even more than you did once before you're you're walking to the next level now again you're at that page energy right but this is having to do with like a very passionate um uh just feel good inspired energy that is also very spiritually fueled intuitively and spiritually fueled okay very nice capricorn very nice let's get some closing messages here <clears throat> Whoopsie poopsie. <sighs> Closing messages here for Capricorn, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter Spirit. Closing messages for Capricorn, please. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Any closing messages for this reading, please, Spirit? Any closing messages for this reading, please, Spirit? Any... Thank you. Bro, I can't even. I can't even. You guys have the teacher learning a new path. You guys also have the divine presence energy, number 44. Teacher was number eight. The force of love and creation. And then you guys have balance, number 24. Centered energy, self-care. I'm going to leave this here, Capricorn.
bottom of the deck is your eternal spirit number 43 higher self and sacred intuition with journey guide number 22 travel and change in location at the bottom of the deck i love you i appreciate you and i'll speak to you guys in the next one bye